Mark will just stand itself up and crush this guy. Yes! Yay! Yay! Uh, how do they respond to tickling? <laughs> what if I, what if I have Given the that one... they are dead, they probably don't have a great okay. nervous system. Okay, scrap that, yeah. scrap that. You're crawling, you're dying, you're bleeding out. Okay. Roll me a d20, see if you slip closer or further away from death. Fifteen is one nice. success, so you've nice. got one out of your three successes. I should also mention, if you ever get a nat one on your death saves, that's that's two failures. Oh. If you ever get a nat twenty, you in immediately get back up again. You're stabilised and you're back at one hit point. So you are you are you are dying. You're barely conscious. What do you want to do? Do you want to move? Do you want to what? crawl towards Can somebody I or away from anybody? Can I have some more successes to get back? <laughs> to <laughs> you can't do anything else to do that right now. Okay. Uh, but you can crawl. Uh, you can choose to do actions while you're at zero as well in my games but any action you choose to take gives you an automatic failure. It's like a way of sacrificing yourself heroically by being like, I'll hold them off, and whatever. Right, right. If I sacrifice myself, am I dead? I can't play this fun game exactly. anymore. Exactly, so, <laughs> so I would recommend not doing that, okay. just crawling away to safety or something. What yeah. do you want to do? I'm having a look in my backpack. <laughs> <laughs> Gets hit by a ballista bolt, goes down dead, and he's like, I'll just check my inventory in case I've got something in here. I've got a mess kit, <laughs> I've got a torch, got some rations. Is it disguise yourself? <laughs> <laughs> disguise yourself on the ground, be like, I'm a tree, I'm a, I'm a shrub, don't attack me. Oh. Yeah. It's not going to be useful for it's you. It's not no. useful, okay. My oh. question to you is, do you want to move? That's all I'm asking. Is that good? Should I do that? <laughs> Probably, yeah. Get away from the line of the ballista ball. Yeah, okay. I'll move behind the tree. Crawling behind the tree. So yeah. you can go half movement when you're crawling, so you can crawl, 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 even behind a trail of blood. <laughs> uh, and you can get out of the line of the ballista. All right, that is Horatio's turn. Buble, you're oh up. All right. I'm in two minds. Would it, uh, would it be helpful if I take that puddle onto Horatio and freeze it so that at least... Staunches the blood. Yeah, it's just. I would, I would allow you to make a medicine check oh, by doing that. That's clever. A medicine check. Yeah. Ooh. You would add your medicine modifier, and then if it's above a certain number, you can give her give her one success. Uh, swipe. Medicine modifier. That's how it works. Is it the swipe? Right? It's like the one where perception and stuff is. If you've got anything that can cure wounds or like heal or anything, if you've got There's any healing magic, magic, that is the best thing to do when somebody's mm. down because it automatically just brings them straight back up again. If you have any. If you don't I have, don't know if you don't I have do. healing, then just medicine checks is the best that you can do. Yeah, I don't think I'm very helpful with the healing. All right, um, what are you doing? So then? yeah, medicine check to see if I can just at Move least the water freeze. on and try and do some avatar heal healing water bullshit. Yeah. Okay. That. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank okay. You. Roll me a medicine check. So roll that and add your medicine modifier. Oh, Jesus Christ. What um, was it? A 20? No, it was five um, and oh. a three, so it's an eight. So you, <laughs> you wet her is what you achieve with that. You, well you throw water on her. <laughs> After crawling through the muddy, muddy terrain, she just washes your wounds. That's, that's about as good as it's going to go. You're clean now. Yeah. So if you survive, you're, you're less likely to get infected. <laughs> yeah. Okay, great. <laughs> Don't worry. I've got you. God, water is so much heavier on land. There you go. How was that? Did that help? No? You're just really wet now and more muddy? Well, uh, at least I cleaned your wounds. <laughs> <laughs> that's, your, that's your action. You've got a movement and bonus if you want to take it. Okay. W bonus? What, how much can I do with the bonus? Is that like a full... Whatever it says you can do with a bonus. Oh, jeepers. What does it say? Oh, no. <laughs> Buble, uh, we've got actions. We've got oh. bonus actions. Let's see oh. what you've got. Nothing. Oh, yeah. You've got nothing you can do with a bonus. Sick. Oh. That's awesome. Um, <laughs> you didn't take Wicked. any bonus action spells or anything. Oh, yeah. Uh, so I can just move so now. So you've got movement yeah. left. Um, I'm going to... I think I'm just going to stay there. Okay. Yeah. Right behind your ice, ice ball protecting you. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Do yes. the druids have any magic, like healing magic? They might, on their NPC turn, which is now. Yeah. Can yeah. okay. they heal Horatio? So we're going to deal with the, uh, uh, the captain first. Yeah. He sees yeah. this guy. He's going to take another attack at him to see if he can take him down to zero. He hits, the guy goes down to zero, the constitution save, the undeath fortitude, uh, the DC goes up so he doesn't make it this time. The guy goes down, not to get back up again this time. Yay! Yay! Oh, he takes out, and he takes out the horse and crushes him. No! <laughs> no! no. <laughs> no. <laughs> he did. I heard I mean, nothing. He just, I heard nothing. <laughs> um, your hunter's mark is now floating around again. Uh, he did one attack against this guy, so he's going to then maneuver the horse around. He's going to pull on the reins. 
uh, when the horse knows exactly what that means. <laughs> it means to back up, as we all know. Pulling on reins means to back up. Um, so it's going. <laughs> that is true. It's not going to work like, if she's not listening to me. Yeah. I'm trying to yeah. her and she's not no, bloody paying attention. I'm just looking um, at my feet. Um, <laughs> no, pulling on the reins like this would make us back up. I know. So you are. Um, <laughs> and then he's going to get the charge feature from charging cool. down here. I've definitely given myself the room for this. All right. Yeah. You can charge that guy, see if the horse hits. <coughs> <coughs> that horse misses again. The horse isn't doing a great job. Oh, maybe we do. It is a prey animal, so. Maybe it's a, yeah, maybe it's not a war horse. Maybe it's not trained. All right, so he's going to pull around the side of him then, and with his last attack, he's also going to hit. So that guy's taking a little bit of damage from you from the arrow. Yeah. And he takes more damage from this guy, not enough to kill him, though. So he's striking and slashing at him. Um... Then we've got the NPCs. Yeah, uh, let's go. I'll say this one, the one that I've been controlling, the orc uh, druid woman. You see that she looks across to the, uh, the, the rock. She seems to be analyzing something for a second. And then she, she turns into a, um, a, a, a bird of some kind, like a little sparrow or something. <gasps> and then flies, flies into the... Um, into the town. So, she saw the hellfire oh, no. disappear, dude. Yeah. Oh. I, re I reckon she's seen something bad on the rock, like yeah. the, that the, those guys are about to appear. Yeah. She, oh. she knows weird. something. I think that's a bad sign. Yeah, I, I think, think so, so too. This guy turns around and he goes, cure wounds at level 100. Okay, <laughs> awesome. And <laughs> greater, than, greater than a god. Yeah. <laughs> and, and Horatio stands back up. Okay, yeah. I will allow and it. The best I will allow some bullshit. <laughs> uh, he runs over and with his action, he, he yeah, conjures the, uh, the, the, the plants around you to sort of grow around you in like a, a comforting cocoon of sorts. And then oh. the plants uh, start to wilt away like the life from them is being drained into you and they wilt oh. and fall off of you. He casts Cure Wounds on you uh, and you're going to take, uh, f sorry, uh, five points of healing. So you can just heal yourself for five and it'll, uh, it'll stabilize you and you are conscious and able to move again. Wait. Any other NPCs doing anything? Ulrich's oh, dying aim? currently. Oh, um, you chose, I'm just gonna put this out there. You controlled that NPC Brit and you had the choice of who to save and you went for Horatio. So oh, if Ulrich dies, that's on you. Oh, no. I'm sorry, I, but let's right. be realistic. Right. We didn't need to save. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> do I need Horatio? <laughs> do I have to do anything to my thing with the, the healing points? Am I meant to Yeah, just put, put healing into it somehow. Where does it say? Wherever it says to heal. Uh, if you hit on your... At the moment, I've just got this death save is the only... That's um, what Underneath that, where it says heal. Oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, that green button there with the oh, numbers. Heal. You can put five into that number box and hit the green button heal. Thank you. It will heal you for five. Okay, uh, so Ulrich and, and Reginald, what's happening there? Well, he's got Should I, I roll death saves for Ulrich? Yeah, I guess. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that is a six. That is a failure. Oh. Ulrich is going closer and closer oh. to death. Oh. Reginald oh, is... It's deep, it's deeply, um, he's despair, in despair yeah. right now. But he's also got a threat next to him. Exactly, right? and he's got a, you know, that's a threat to Ul Ulrich. Mm -hmm. So he's gonna attack um, All right. this guy. All right, make yeah. an attack roll. He's gonna, and he's, he's like crying while he does it. Oh, it's five. Five, <laughs> that's, gonna miss, that's gonna miss. I'll, I'll say he's got advantage because he's in a fury at yeah. His, yeah. the lover's rage, get, puts him into a, a barbarian rage. Yeah. He's got advantage on the reckless attack. So roll uh, roll yeah. it. 14. 14 is enough. Yes! Yes! Go takes this guy out. See ya. And then he jumps on him and just starts hammering away and tearing yeah. the rib cage up. <laughs> You're not coming back. Yeah. Uh, he makes yeah. sure that this guy's not coming back to life. Mm -hmm. Good yeah. work, Reginald. How about the rest? What have we got? No more zombies uh, over here. We've got yeah. these two. Should we have these And then fellas? this archer and this archer. Oh, maybe they go for And we've got these guys on the stealth mission as well. Oh, that's more important, right? I don't know. What do you want to do? Yeah, get them to where's get these the guys rock, up. Where's the rock that that druid looked at and ran away? It's like, oh, yeah. it's way over there. Okay. Yeah, maybe get them to shoot the brute. All right. Or, or advance? Can they? Or, yeah. Anyone... They're going to advance up here. Uh, that's going to be as far as they can get with uh, their turn, so they're going to use their action to just rush in. Oof. Um, oh, none so of them are get, shooters, right. They, yeah, none of them have got ranged oh. weapons. <coughs> this guy's got ranged weapon and has done nothing the entire fight. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's like, you got this. Yeah. I wish I could disappear into a bottle. <laughs> I'm, I'm good over here. Who is he? Maybe he should go inside the gate Mysterious. and help the other Mysterious. druid. She pulls a cloak over his face and disappears yeah, or away from the battle. at least go more guarding the gate? Yeah, maybe we just Can make him move. Can into the... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sacrifice nice. himself. Um, all right, these guys have moved in. We've got these guys and these guys. What are we doing? Should we have those guys attack? These guys attack yeah. these ones. Yeah. Rush oh, around thanks. here to help uh, you two make an attack roll for them. 
16. Eight. Yeah, you managed to hit with a 16 and then with an eight. Uh, I'll say it goes down. Why not? Oh, yeah. Let's move things forward. Woo. You kill those guys. Uh, and then these guys rush up and try and take out the archer. Yeah. No, this guy, I don't really care. He's <laughs> really annoying about the whole log Tree, thing. Dude. Thank <laughs> you for killing him. <laughs> <laughs> rush up. Uh, all right, two of you roll for this one again. <clears throat> like that? Yep. Log guy. Six. 14. 14 will do it. Oh, or nine. They're right next to each other and I moved it. That's fine. 14, 14 was enough. Oh, cool, cool, cool. All right. Uh, that is, we're pretty much clearing up here. They're doing pretty well. Top of the round. Arrow, what are you going to do? I'm going to... I'm going to I'm gonna hit this one. Hit that one? Attack, attack that one this, with my This dual. one here? Yeah, dual. Wait, no, wait, wait. You're going to hit this one? Wait, is that not our... You're going to hit this, this dwarf militia guy? <laughs> no. <laughs> with a line of wisdom. With a line of wisdom and praise. You're going to hit just, him with a line. Yeah. You're going to oh hit God, him with a compliment. such a good job. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I do. Take that, you dirty zombie! <laughs> Oh no, you're a dwarf, not a... I'm so sorry. Oh no, you're like bleeding out of head and artery right there. Oh God, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Can I help? Can I help? Can I get CPR? A little bit, I could try. What's the song? What's the song? Huh? I don't know the song, is it? Huh? Huh? Like two beats? Oh no, he's unconscious. Wake up! Wake up! Oh, oh, you're doing a great, great job, great job. Um, In that case, I'm this one, afraid of that, whatever that's doing. This one's alive, yeah. the ballista's still going. Yeah. These two are still in a bowl of I've ice, which I'm going to say is to starting to there. fall. I've but what it's going to take a while. Oh, look, I'm going um, to I'm gonna go up and just I'm going to attack this guy. Attack this guy, you're do it. With your movement, you can get to him, so make your attack. And yeah. you've got a bonus action to move your hunter's mark if you want, or you can bonus action use your yeah, offhand attack. Do this. I'm just knocking. All right. Because I'm using it. You move the. Oh, cool, a four. You, <laughs> <laughs> you whip the uh, the grass towards him, but then you strike out, and you're expecting guts, so you're like going for guts, and yeah. then you're like, man, there's, there's pretty much only bone. So you cut through um, some of his uh, his clothing and realize that he's mo mostly rotted away. He's got no innards anymore. He's mainly a skeleton. Okay. Uh, cool. So that's a miss, unfortunately. But you are now within melee range of him, at least. Um, do I have any bonus actions? No, that is it. Uh, bonus section was to move hunters, Matt. Yeah, just kidding. All right, so now it is skeletons and zombies' turn, which I think is just the guy that you're in. I'm going to give these two a save now to see if they can break the ice from the inside. See if they can. Uh, nope, not with those rolls. Yeah. And then this guy Stupid. is going to try and just bonk you with his uh, bony arm to see if he can hit you. Uh, that is going to hit. But he's disadvantage, right? You, oh yes, thank you for the reminder. Nice. Well, remember. <laughs> I'm just going to really hang on for the disadvantage. Yeah. yeah, that turns it into a miss. So again, yes. he goes to hit you, and then blind the the light shines up from you and blinds you. Ah. Cool. Yeah. Uh, I think that's all of the baddies. So they're almost done. Sneaky, what are you doing? Yay! <clears throat> so Horatio's up now, eh? Uh, right. so Horatio is, you, you look back and see Horatio being healed and Horatio is starting to cool, cool, uh, cool. come consciousness, con come to consciousness. <clears throat> All right. Am I, can I shoot in range? Like, am I... You're within range of this guy. Okay, so could I hide behind you the tree? hide as a bonus section okay. or a stealth check. You need to beat his passive perception score. That's a nine. Plus eight. Plus 17. Eight. 17 is enough. You are considered hidden from him. You disappear nice. behind the trees. He doesn't know where it came from. He's distracted by all the NPCs around yep. him. Uh, and, and trying to reload the, um, the ballista. Cool. Uh, you can now make an attack with advantage, and if you hit because you're out of advantage and he's surrounded, you get sneak attack. Cool, all right. Oops, 10, or four, so <laughs> hopefully. So the 10 plus your modifier is six, six right? I think. So yep. 16 is enough to hit, so roll your damage. You've got a d4, 2d6. Mm, and you've got an inspiration if you want to uh, add it. Oh, you can't add it to damage, but it's fine. Okay, three. And then, can Three, I roll both those as two, my yeah. sneak? Six and one, uh, seven, so that's ten. Seven to, so that's uh, ten points plus your four from uh, dexterity is fourteen points of damage, which is enough Whee. to kill him. Let's see if his undead fortitude happens. Not with a two, it doesn't. So, yeah. describe the kill. Okay, so I... The final guy that's uh, of any worth on the battlefield, what do you want to do with him? Okay, I'm going to go from the sneaking. I want to quickly, like, duck in under a branch. I'm gonna say, <laughs> my anaconda don't want that. Oh, to go yes. Up, um, and I'm gonna shoot him in the butt. Nice. In the yeah. 
butthole. Right in the butthole. Oh, oh, oh. He tends, he tends to, to, yeah, he tends to load the, the ballista. <laughs> <laughs> it hits him right in the uh, the coccyx, which shatters and like starts like a um, cascading domino effect all the way up his spine. Each vertebra kind of drops down into the Jesus. place of the last one because of how oh. rotten he is. <laughs> and then his whole like, back know. kind of collapses under his own weight. <laughs> And he falls down, narrowly avoiding this guy. Oh, he <laughs> dives to the side. Yeah! And yes. for the sake of brevity, you manage to uh, surround this rock, and sh uh, surround the ice, rather, and shatter it open, and then just slaughter these two, and the cool. and you manage to kill this guy with your hunter's knife. Boom! Yay! Well done. The last thing to, uh, to decide, then, is what's happening to Ulrich? <sighs> Reginald, stabilize oh. him. Reginald gets down. Does CPR and he's giving, giving or um, CPR? <laughs> Reginald's going to make a medicine check. Makes so a for tourniquet you, or whatever. Medicine check, please. <coughs> so, uh, just a straight Thank D ten. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. No, Come no, on, lovers. Ten. Uh, ten. That, uh, Yay! That's a that's a D twelve. I meant no, a straight no, D twenty. You said the one with ten on it, right? <laughs> <laughs> and I got the highest number of that. Oh, so. That was a D twelve. <laughs> Five. Five. Oh. He is. He's failing. He's failing. It's oh. not failing by enough to like cause him extra oh. deaths. Uh, but then the furball runs over. I want to see. Has the furball got any more spell, yes. uh, any more hit, uh, hit point? Oh uh, no, he's not going to fudge it either. He has. Yeah, he has. Uh, he has. Uh, I'm going to say a D4 minus two spell slots left. One. So he has no spell slots. Oh left. no! So the, fur Aww. the furball druid is out of spell slots. Can he medicine check or no? He's going to try his medicine <laughs> check instead. You suggested it, so roll me a d20. <laughs> 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 How invested you are in this NPC? Eighteen. Wow. Eighteen, wow. 18 is one success. Oh, He's starting to stabilise him. He's yes. still making death saves yes. though. He's going to then on, fail. Come on, oh, my oh, guy. Make a death save. Stay with he us. He succeeds. Yeah. All right, that is two successes Ooh. and one failure. What is anybody else doing before it comes back around to him again? <laughs> Silver dude runs up and is like, <laughs> I used to go to med school. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he did. Yeah. Fantasy med school. Yeah, I've, yeah. I've studied first aid. He's We're like, I get an wrong. advantage on this. I'm Don't <laughs> touch him, Reginald I'm a says. Cardiothoracic Trust surgeon. me. Oh no, he's dying. Someone help him. I can't do shit. Gareth, to the rescue. Get out of the way. Oh. I went to med school. What's a med school? Well, I got a first aid degree. I was valedictorian, first in my class. A plus plus plus. Uh, are you speaking? They all the they all mean what? things. Uh, I'm not making this up. All right. So first you've got to do is uh, work out which holes he's meant to have and which holes he's not meant to. Have. This one I think needs plugging. Oh, yep, oh. that's yep, that's what's meant to happen. Uh, trust me, uh, he's got too much blood. That means that he's got too much. The humors are not in alignment, um, and this arm is clearly in the way. So I'm just going to take this one off. <clears throat> Help me pull this. Help me pull this. It's not meant mm -hmm. to be attached. No. I don't, I don't help, me pull, you. help me pull his, help me pull his arm. I don't want to get near you. I went to med school, trust me. I don't know what it is, alright? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> and he plugs his... I've, tra <laughs> I've trained in paramedics. <laughs> he's got a whole eye right. drip that he's dragging over. <laughs> one of, neither of you two have rolled for him yet, so one of you two, oh. whoever wants to take it. Yeah. Okay. He's feeling more lucky. Alright. Okay. All right. Oh. oh yeah. There's a four. Oh, He's making it worse. No, no, no. I no. Trust me, you're meant to move them as much as possible. <laughs> Get the circulation moving. Start setting them up and moving them about. Oh, no. Reginald's oh, no. like, I'm pretty sure he's not. It's not enough oh, to cause him no. another failure, but then it's going to come back around to him oh, again. Unless, no. unless you as characters want to do anything, you're just uh, using the MPC. Can Sneaky reach? You can, you can now on your next turn fly over to him. Fly I, over okay. Horatia. I, have, I also have a plan, but I don't know if I am able to. Can I turn him into a vampire? <gasps> Whoa. It's better than being Jeff for all eternity, my guy. So as, as Sneaky is running over to try some healing, what do the rest of you want to do? What? Are you, you going to do that first? I don't know. What's going You're happen? running over to turn him. I just wanted to see if anybody else is so doing we're not anything taking first. Turns? I mean, kind of. It's loosey goosey because we're okay, just... loosey goosey. Okay, 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 okay. Uh -huh. I um, I start um, singing him a song. Okay, okay. <laughs> that inspires him. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah it's nice. So nice. you're gonna cast it. You're gonna give him an inspiration. Excellent. Yes. Tell so, him it'll be their wedding song. Yeah. 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 yeah he has make to a, live. Make a make uh, a make a roll with your. Uh, sorry, no, you're not rolling. You're just doing a bardic inspiration. Um, and so you're going to give him a d6 onto his next death save. Uh, he's saying, Was man <laughs> only fools. And it's like romantic. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. I love it. Um, <laughs> it is going to get back round. So by the time you can get to him, let's see. I'm going to roll one more, one more time for his death save with a d6 added to it. 
Uh, that is a six plus three, which is a nine, which is still a failure. So oh. he, lo he fails one more death save. Oh. He's on the verge of absolute death. Okay. You arrive to him. I see he's bleeding out on the ground. I can see that his partner is just sobbing. And I think... Please. You gotta do, do it. Please don't give anything. All right, don't I leave guess. me, Ulrich. Like, don't leave me. And so I decide... You've got, to, you've got to live your life. No. No. Go on. You deserve to be happy. I, I lunge in and with the vampiric... I hope, I hope that you can find happiness with somebody else one day. <laughs> you run down into his throat. No! Ulrich's like, oh, no. uh, Reginald is freaking I'll, out. No! I'll, you I'll, bite I'll, down into his throat. I'll and turn big and grab Reginald. Yeah. Just I use my like, a <laughs> venom. It's anti-venom. <laughs> and um, I've made the choice now, so he will live for eternity if this works. Okay. But, you know. Uh, the fun thing is, is the fun thing is, you have cure wounds, and you have spell slots left. <laughs> no, but <laughs> so just putting story. that out there. <laughs> <There's>, <laughs> but you, Wait, this whole time you picked cure yeah, wounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's right there. She's only, got, she's only got four spells as a ranger. No, I'm out of spell slots. Hunter's mark. I'm out of spell protection slots. from evil and good. Speak with animals and cure wounds. I've used all my spell slots. You've cast hunter's mark twice. Yeah, right? I've 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 got three. Sp I look. I'm out of spell slots. So I couldn't oh, have yeah, done it. I couldn't protection have done from it. evil and good. I couldn't have done to, uh, it. I couldn't have done it. I couldn't have done it. Well done, well done. Okay, well done. Well done. okay yes, you couldn't have done it. Well done. So you instead <laughs> turn him. Uh, so this is going to be a case of... He was on two fails and two successes, I think, mm. from memory. Uh, so if, he, if I get above a 10 on this, so a 10 or more, I'll say, mm. uh, he, w he will not succumb to the, da the extra damage that you've just inflicted on him and will instead... Uh, will instead succumb to the, the, like the vampiric will, venom. Will Bella become a vampire? Eight. Ooh. So Ooh. instead... <laughs> but does he still have bardic inspiration or whatever? Or oh. He used this bardic inspiration Oh up. no! So, oh guys, I think I killed... He was going to die anyway. It was, it was, <laughs> oh, it was no. pretty heroic of you to try and save this NPC. Uh, so I'll give you a hero point token, which you can immediately cash in to then make it a success if you will. Yes. <laughs> nice. Yes. Okay. You then use because your hero point token the to he heroically me. turn this guy into a vampire. Yay! I'm a vampire. I'm doing do all right. I'm a vampire and I, is this, it's all good. Is this the first spawn that you've created? Yes. Yeah, that's big pretty, time. That's pretty big. That's pretty, that's uh, a big, deal. pretty big to, oh, to I was, What can I say? I was moved by the power of love. You, <laughs> yeah. Ulrich's like trying to beat beat on you and, and the, the furball druid is like, what the? And he uses a mold earth uh, cantrip to just sort of poof, push you back as like a, uh, a, stone, a pillar of stone erupts from beneath you, <laughs> pushing you back. Get off him! Um, and then you're, you, you rush in like, yeah. oh, I think, because you've not met her before. No, I haven't, so, no. So you're just holding this guy back from, <laughs> yeah. you just also witnessed the vampire <laughs> bite into this guy. Yeah. And your first instinct is, no, it's fine. Yeah. For some reason. Sneaky lives for the chaos. Yeah, she does. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she does. I'm going to whisper and it's, it's all right. Just let it be. <laughs> it's so creepy, I love it's it. It's so creepy. <laughs> Um, uh, retreat behind the walls he gives the command and uh, and the remaining people start to rush forwards uh, and head back in in the walls Whew! What happened? wow that took a while wait is he all right I want... wait. he's he, his, he... he starts to stir after after a, a few moments of wow wow you feel the, the blood pulse into your mouth you taste it you taste the iron the the, the delicious metallic -y kind of fresh blood you make a wisdom save just to see if you take right. more than you should Oh no, I'm very restrained. 19. All right, you are, no, you are in control you. of your well own done. mind enough that you nice. can pull out just at the right moment mm -hmm. to... <laughs> <Nope>. <laughs> 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 okay. Whoa, I mean, it's You've... phallic symbolism right there. Exactly, so. yeah. Yeah. So that's what vampires are all about. Um, you managed to pull, pull yourself back and, and uh, <coughs> just have uh, sapped enough of him and given yourself enough to him to, uh, to give him blood. You, do you ex try and explain to um, Reginald? I what say, the situation is? Uh, I say, uh, I say, so sorry. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but My at the end of the day, it's better than you know. It's better than him being dead for all of eternity. Uh, you have, you have to, you'll have to be very careful for the he's first. He's so confused because he doesn't know what's oh, happened. Oh, he's undead. He doesn't know what's happened. He's just... I say, I say, sorry, sorry. Did I? Not? He's undead now, but he's alive, but he's dead. Is that? <laughs> killed him. No, no, he's alive. Sort of. What are you talking? He looks down and he's not moving, and then there's a twitch. twitch yeah, see? Look at and that. Then... <laughs> what? Yeah. How? Uh, the blood has stopped pumping now. It's he's... just got open wounds to it. It's called vampirism, and have fun. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> and, then I, and then I walk away. I'm sure he can put two and two together. He seems like a yeah, smart Yeah, he's, he's just left stunned as mm. the rest of you 
mm. walk off. That um, doesn't feel right. Sneaky's just going to like cackle to herself. <laughs> and then leave. Mm. I'm going to add to my notes Ulrich. Make him an NPC yes! that actually exists nice. now. And that was yeah. a vampire, original. Vampire yes. Ulrich. Of Why not? <laughs> now we get to see them all the time, I imagine. I hope as so. You, as, you, um, uh, as you all head back inside the gates, uh, Captain U Ulang is there and he thanks you for your services. He's, he's stopped to sort of thank everybody that's coming in and uh, uh, expresses gratitude and, and um, appreciation of their, their valour. I'm going to ask for payment. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Seeky's going to be like, says, you're welcome, but um, what you got? Thank you. You fought bravely. Thank you, outsider. We can never repay you. You have courage, and most importantly, you have... Money. I was going to say honour, but yes, I suppose it's only fair. Uh, now, let's see. Of the town's coffers, we can probably afford all of that. Thank you for your valuable and virtuous assistance. Yeah. I, um... I know that uh, a lot of them are heading to the gloopy slop for drinks to celebrate. I can arrange for the mayor to take the tab of that, and uh, if she so wishes, if she sees fit, I believe she will be rewarding people uh, with what what little coffers the um, uh, the town has. Mm. Right. I'm scared that in the um, what's it called gloopy slop? Gloopy, gloopy slop. Gloopy slop that gloopy we slop. might see those scary guys. Where did they, <laughs> where did they go? <laughs> did you see that? Did you guys <laughs> see that? Yeah. I saw that. I, did, I didn't see it. I heard about it. I yeah, I'm, I'm worried. worried. Mm. You are a um, skilled fighter, he says to you, Ara. You can tell there's more, more to that than he, he meant. Like he's. There was more to that than he meant. Yeah, there's, there's, <laughs> he's Say that out loud. <laughs> Just <laughs> musing out loud. <laughs> I, we are not used to your kind, but I am appreciative that you are fighting on our side. Oh. You are welcome. Blood's and then still, I bow. Blood's still and dripping down your chin. <laughs> Walk away. <laughs> okay. um, so if you want to, you can head to the um, uh, to the, the gloopy slop, which is the tavern of, the, of Dimwood, um, uh, or you can do whatever you want. It's an open world. You can do what you wish. Uh, you, the time is now yours, and it is late. Uh, late. Uh, it's getting late into the evening, early in the night. Uh, you okay. can see that Captain Ulang and the uh, actual trained militia, the ones that aren't dead, are going to recover the bodies of the fallen now and start mm. to give, dig graves. Can I pretend that I'm going to like help with the dead bodies, but I'm going to loot them? <laughs> you yeah, absolutely can. Make a deception check. 18. Plus your deception modifier is going to be plenty enough. Uh, you ask Captain Ulang, can I, can I help out? And he goes, oh, yes, please, the more the merrier. Yeah, uh, cool. The more hands will be... <laughs> many hands make like work. work. And, uh, and you head off to one of the bodies <laughs> to start looting. Uh, make me an investigation check. See how much you manage to loot without getting, uh, without getting a bit, too, uh, a bit okay. too obvious with it. Or 18 plus zero. Whew. All right. Nice. Uh, you're going to roll me a d4. Okay. One. You're going to find one gold piece. You're going to roll me a d6. Three. You're going to find three silver pieces, and you're going to roll me a d20. Ooh. Seven. You're going to find seven copper pieces. So okay. you find uh, a gold piece, uh, three silver pieces, and seven copper pieces. Okay. You also find a small vial of perfume on one of the bodies, um, and you find a, let's see, what else? Um, you find a locket to uh, to a loved one around one of them's uh, Ooh, one of them's necks. Okay, sad. And the locket might be worth something if you wanted to sell it, or yeah. you could do with it what you will. Okay. What are the rest of you doing? I can't wait to go to the tavern. I'm exhausted. <laughs> I'm going to put my hoofs up, have a have some mead, and have a dance. Mm. Excellent. So you head to, off to the gloopy slot to have a dance. Rest of you, what are you doing? I'll go there after looting. You're gonna head there after. Nice. Buble. Mm. I'm a bit of a solo creature that I don't necessarily want to go be around people, but I kind of have no choice because I don't want to lose at least Arrow because mm -hmm. I kind of know of Arrow and I just want to yeah. make sure that I'm wherever Arrow goes. So where's mm. Arrow going? I go, going? hey, I'm going to... I felt real bad before about what I did, so I'm going to take um, Ulrich and Reginald to the tavern. I'm going to buy them a drink. Mm. Nice. Do you want to come with us? I'll oh, come nice. with you, yeah. yeah. All right. You then. Wonderful. You all head to the gloopy slop. Uh, you all <laughs> arrive at various times, but you get there... You see that spirits in the air is, uh, are very much mixed. Um, there are some people here who are just downing their sorrows at losing loved ones. Uh, others are more cheerful because they're celebrating the victory. Um, 
what what sort of a thing would you do in the in the tavern? You're going to have a, uh, a dance. You, would you grab a table in the corner? Mm. Would you be like right out in the open? Would you you're joining festivities. There's lots of people here in here who would be playing games. There's darts. Mm. There's dominoes. There's dice and cards. I go up to a table in the corner. Um, okay. With lots of seats, so if you want to sit with us, you can. But we get one in the corner. It's sort of shadowy, dark. And then I go up to the bar to buy some drinks for the party that we're with. And I'm sorry that you hurt your head when you <laughs> fell from heaven. Oh, oh, oh. I'm a Horatio. It's like fellatio, but Horatio? Like anything you want. Oh. I didn't want you to think that I thought we were friends already. You oh, know? Just in not? case. <laughs> no, it's just in case that you didn't think we were. I didn't want you to think that I thought we were, you know? So, you're a vampire, yeah? Bold. Hey guys, if you've been enjoying watching us, please consider buying some merch. We have some over at vldl.shop. Look at it, it's cool, it's flaming, it's very cool. You'll be very hot if you wear these, so check them out.